What's going on everyone, Cubologist here again today, and I've got another quick average of fire for you guys. This time it's on the Diane Paraminx. I'm actually working on the review for that, so expect that to be out within the next day or two. And it has been three days since I uploaded. Three days, that is unheard of. And I wish I had a really good excuse for you guys because I was just being lazy. So, <laughs> sorry about that. Typically that doesn't happen, so like I said, sorry. I've been relaxing, playing Counter-Strike, you know, really important things. But now we're back to it and things should be back on schedule. But let's get into the questions really quick. Sid Hearth asks what microphone I use. I actually use the USB version of the Shure PG42. So if you guys are interested, you can look that up. It is S-H-U-R-E. Uh, it's a really good microphone. It's a really good condenser. So you guys definitely check that out if you're looking for some pretty high quality audio. And then Gruffalo Cubing says, are you going to buy the YJ Megaminx? I have actually just ordered that, so yes, it is definitely coming. Now, I'm horrible at Megaminx, but I think that I know how a puzzle should turn, so I can definitely give you some type of input on how I think it turns and breaks in and stuff like that. Then the Z Gamer asks, why did you switch mains? And I've actually got this question a lot through personal messages and stuff like that. I switched mains only because I was getting faster times with the Hualong. It has nothing to do with anything Moyu or Gans related or anything like that. I simply got better times with the Hualong, and that's what I'm going to go with every time. If I start getting better times with a Rubik's Cube, I'm going to use a Rubik's Cube, but that will never happen. Then Stephanie asks, are you left-handed, right-handed, or mixed-handed? I'm actually right-handed, but back when I thought I was cool and I lifted weights and stuff like that, which was ages ago, I was actually stronger with the left side of my body. So definitely as far as coordination goes, I'm more coordinated with the right side of my body, right foot, and right hand. But as far as strength goes, yeah, probably the left side. Then Anthony says, why you don't answer my questions? Well, Anthony, this is the first one I've seen and I'm answering it, so sorry about that. But that's gonna be all as far as questions go for today. I actually have a question for you guys and it involves this series. Now, as you all know, I'm horrible with keeping up the three episodes a day on the day that they're supposed to come out. But do you think this is getting pretty stale? I had a couple comments talking about how this is getting old. Now, I really like this series and I like interacting with you guys, but do you think I should step it back and do like one average of 12 per week like I used to do with the Road to Sub 20? Should I just do it twice a week or do you think it's just fine? I just know that there's been a lot of repeated questions and things and I've tried to avoid them to keep this series pretty up to date. But other than that, I really enjoy it and I just wanna know what you guys think. Let me know down in the comments. But as far as the Diane Paraminx goes, I'm not getting great times with it. And there's a few reasons for that. I think one of them is the actual puzzle. Uh, the main reason is I'm horrible at Paraminx, but Definitely not super impressed with the puzzle, but more to come on the review. Thanks for watching, guys, and you'll hear from me really soon. Later.